is what's wild in New Hampshire by wildlife biologist Eric Orff. <laughs> what's this? The 7th of, uh, I think it's the 7th of September, 2024. Looking down here at this brook. At <laughs> this brook where two summers ago, I caught the New Hampshire Department of Environmental Services doing a fish, fish survey of this brook near my house. And from where you can see down there, just beyond that, up another... Now, 60 yards past the, the road that I'm sitting on, they found, I think, 13 species of fish. <laughs> yep, this little brook, the Suncook River is down there maybe 300 yards from right here. No more than that, maybe less. So the Suncook River is just beyond by a couple hundred yards, 300 yards from what you can see right there. So it's close to the river, and maybe that was one reason why it had so many different species of fish. Of course, many of them were little minnow-sized fish, two or three inches long, but there was also an American eel right down there, and, of course, wild brook trout, native brook trout, and uh, I think two or three species of sunfish, and uh, things like that, things that you would normally find in our brooks and streams. Here is the summer flow this September 7th. Got some rain coming in tonight. I think this brook could use a little breath of fresh water, fresh, hopefully cool water. Our nights have been cooling down into the 50s here. Oh, the brooks are starting to cool down. Good for our wild trout to be doing that. And this is the time of year, you know, they're, they are going into ready to breed and uh, therefore probably more stressed than in other times of the year. Breeding activity, changing color. Uh, well, anyways, uh, yeah. Be careful of our wild trout out there. And uh, don't stress them too much with catching them over and, and over in one small area. Be best not to stress them any more than they are with low water. We can see low water. Although way better than it has been in many of the last decades. You know, in the last decade we've had droughts. In five of the of the last ten years, 2022 was, I think, the worst drought since I've lived here in town 45 years. Yeah. Brook is looking pretty good for early September. Expecting some rain tonight, which certainly is needed to freshen up this brook a little bit. Get some more cool water flowing into the brook for our trout. <laughs> yeah. Our brooks are wild today.